Hey, what's going on guys? Sean here, living the corporate pilot life. Got a quick Tech Tuesday video for you guys on something that's been coming up a lot in the comments section, and that's on the auto throttle system and the uh, left throttle in particular on this airplane. You guys have probably noticed while we're in cruise that the uh, left throttle moves forward and back a little bit while the right side is, uh, is not really moving too much. And the reason for that is because of the throttle cable. There's actually a cable, a physical cable, that runs from the throttle quadrant here in the cockpit all the way back to the engines on the fuel control valve, controlling how much fuel goes into the engine. Uh, along the way on that cable we have obviously sensors and servos and things like that controlling things, but one of those is the auto throttle uh, servo. It's very susceptible to tension change on that cable. If that cable has a little too much uh, tension or a little too much slack in it, and we're talking just a fraction of a pound here, it can really affect how it works. So that tension is set while we're down here on the ground at you know 20 degrees Celsius, something like that. When we take off, get up into the air, we're at minus 60 degrees Celsius. That temperature really affects the shrinkage of the airplane and all the systems. Keep in mind, we have an aluminum bodied aircraft and we have a stainless steel cable. So the uh, shrinkage from temperature is different between those two uh, materials. So the reason the right side doesn't really change very much is because it's got a newer cable on the right side. So the shrinkage and the temperature doesn't really affect it very much. The left side has the older cable on it. Maybe someday it'll get changed, but as of right now, it's still got an older cable in it, just a little more dated, so it's more susceptible to that tension change due to temperature. So that's why you see that little bit of movement on that left throttle. It's nothing to be worried about, nothing to be of any concern. It's just one of the little idiosyncrasies of this particular airplane. Kind of gives it a little bit of character. So hopefully that answers the question on that. Uh, if it doesn't make sense still, feel free to ask some more questions. I'll be happy to answer them all day long. So uh, I'll get you a new tech video next week, and uh, give me the like if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you're new. See you guys next time. Keep living the corporate pilot life.